subscribers, uh, friends, uh, viewers, many people are doing this this morning. They're doing playthroughs, whatnot, on Twitch and whatever. I figured I would do it too, like give you my raw first impressions of the story, the features, and all that stuff. You know, let you uh, see for yourself what the game is about. And, uh, you know, uh, get an idea for yourself while I explain what I feel about the game, uh, the game's expansion. And, uh, let us get into this, because, uh, because I'm anxious to see. I've seen mixed, uh, mixed, uh, reviews about the uh, game. Some people says it's like the same mediocre lukewarm experiences as, as the other expansions and then other people say it's uh, the most awesome thing they've seen so um, I'm definitely curious curious to see what it's all about and uh, and you know just uh, see if it stacks up or not uh, I'm gonna go to the tower I guess and uh collect my goodies. I think there should be some goodies waiting for me in the uh, Postmaster. Um, by the way, good day. I uh, hope it is a good day for you. I uh, hope you're enjoying the day though. so far. Right, if you're going to work, uh, may, maybe you'll uh, get to enjoy this later if you even bought it. and uh, Maybe it'll be good for you. Like I've I've bought every expansion. I've played through part of the raids, uh, not all. I've uh, done a lot of gameplay in this game. I've spent a lot of time with it. Crucible, uh, story, grinding, you name it. I've done it. Like raids, of course. Um, I don't fancy staying you know going through like uh for uh you know one like a five hour session of trying to make my way through a uh raid at the, at the middle of the night or whatever got a spark of light use the spark of light when you are in the tower of the reef for the iron temple to me increase the level of one character to 40 I don't know why I would need that unless I wanted to change one of my characters. Uh, to be honest, I do not know why I would need that um, at this point. Uh, Iron Gajala, Gajala Wing or whatever the frick that is. Uh, Gajala Horn. Um, Iron. It's, it's level 3. What the frick? And, uh, uh, gotta, gotta make some room for that banner, because I wanna, I wanna have that, have that going on stuff. Okay, get that thing. Switch, switch to that real quick. Switch my little, uh, sparrow too while I'm at it. Yeah, but if you pre-ordered, you get the, uh, Sparrow, of course. You get the little horn. Did not know that was a thing, though. Get that. Um. It would have been cool if they had, like, a shader or something, too, but I guess that's asking a little too much. Um, let's see, gonna change to a sniper, my favorite sniper, so I can equip my... Kajarla horn thing of a jig. Uh, what does it say? Requires year three. Good job. What the frick? Year three. Okay, let's see how, how much uh, things I got here. Okay, I don't have enough to purchase that. Uh, so I cannot use that until until I get a year three version of it like like that's kind of stupid 
Uh, I just don't know what to say about that, folks. I do not know what to say about that. I, I no words. Like, uh, anyways. No better time to gear up. Except the quest, the quest lines, yay. Yeah. Let's see, that looked like he had some new, uh... He has some, a new, uh, helmet, new ghost, uh, new crucible shells. Um, look at this, uh, gear, let's, uh, preview this. Looks interesting, uh, poltergeist, um, Raku poltergeist. Now that, that looks like some of the older helmets, to be honest. Uh, um, pattern's different. Uh, do, 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 do. Cloak of Fast Resolve. I'm interested in Cloak's now. That looks pretty sweet. Not gonna lie about that. Uh, uh, see what the uh, dude has over here. And Zero Day Dilemma, Party Favor. So he has some new weapons. Uh, now that's pretty cool. And it looks different. Uh, I am I am really liking uh, some of these new weapon designs here. So uh, it'll give you something to grind for for sure. Um, the new look is, is looks more. Uh, I don't know what you call like uh, curved or something. But man, that that looks sweet. I am not gonna lie, like I am uh sorta of excited about getting some of this uh curtain call. Man, and some of these perks these are beast perks too. Yeah, see uh yeah man this is like uh I I'm loving the stock. Like I am loving the uh the design of these things. Um really cool, really cool. Why they didn't do this earlier, why they didn't change it up more and only waited till the expansion, I just, uh, just don't know. Um, <laughs> there's so much they could have done that they did not do in this game. And, yeah, everybody's got some new, uh, new, uh, gear for your, uh, your, uh, guardians. And they look slightly similar. Um, yeah, not not gonna lie about that. Some of it looks similar to the older stuff, like uh, different patterns on it and things, though different designs. Let's see, the cloak looks pretty cool. I like that cloak. Okay, it's. Uh, Wish I could uh, go with you. Uh, we'll watch this play. Gonna look into this thing and see if the uh, year three uh, weapons are available. Year two, uh, year one. Like, uh, how do you get a year three uh, Gajala horn? You got what you gotta do with the raid or something? That's that's I j I just don't even know. That's like uh, as that's, that's kind of false advertisement. Um, you 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 get like I guess it's the uh, the black and uh, gold uh, skin or whatever, and you gotta have the year three version to actually uh, use it. Yeah, it, it's like telling you you get something but you don't. Um, I am not too happy about the Gajala horn thing. I am not not too happy about that. I'm gonna go check out the rest of the vendors and uh, see see what uh, has changed if anything. And uh, what do you need? Do, do, do. No, he's still the same. Still the same old uh, Banshee over there. Still uh, trying to get you to get those uh, test weapons out there and, and upgrade uh, your uh, standings with them. Why not? Go over here to the ships and see if there's anything, anything worth uh, noting. Let's see, 
Here's what we got today. Uh, still selling the same stuff. SSDD, my friends. SSDD. Um, see what the uh, Vanguard uh, Quartermaster over here has uh, for uh, say. Okay, now that she does have like. Uh, legendaries that are different. Okay, see what she's got. Uh, Seem to be a similar design, different pattern. So, again, they are sort of <laughs> just borrowing the design, slapping on a different uh, skin, calling it something different, putting some different perks on it. Uh, it's laziness. Like, let's be honest. Like, that's all they're doing with that. Uh, um, <sighs> uh, seriously, like, I, I, I don't know that that kind that kind of disappoints me a lot. Uh, and again, like recycled helmet design, uh, different, different uh, take on it, I guess, slightly, maybe different skin. Uh, Endling cloak looks actually ugly this time around. Um, let's see what the armor does. Vested armor, you've seen that before. Just different, different paint job. I guess that's the theme of the new gear. Like, I mean, come on, could you not get more? Look, look, same auto rifle design, just different paint job. Am I uh, only one seeing this? I mean, like. That's the same, same as the others. Different paint job, different uh, perks, though. Different name. Not much <sighs> oh, dude, I I just don't know anymore. Like like, Bungie has gotten lazy. They've gotten lazy with a lot of things. They don't. They show they don't care. They've said they're they've they've cut the staff that works on this game, the uh, commit to the second game. But when you do that kind of thing, you abandon what's now for what could be or what is to be uh... you kind of uh... you kind of leave some people in the dust you kind of uh... just uh... you just you just don't do right by your gamer base doing that kind of thing and I, I just don't know i'm not really uh... not not really impressed by the uh... Re uh reskins and and uh... recycled uh... gear uh, sure, the new designs look cooler, you know, but they're they're the same across the board. I'm gonna go to the uh, the outfit or whatever her name is and see uh, see if she's got anything uh, new worth uh, you know talking about. See if she's got any new shaders or anything. Let's see, Let's see what you got, Eva. What have you got? Uh, she's selling chroma. That's different. Shaders SSDD, emblems SSDD, except for that one. A 7,500 glimmer shader. Now, they could have done better than that. They could have added more different, but they just got that one. And why didn't they? Why didn't they just include that in the uh, package deal? Seriously, I mean, come on, come on, please. I haven't even gotten into the story or anything, and then like, it's dis uh, disappointment right you out the tower, man. It's just uh. You are a true weapon of light. And here, SSDD is is just like uh. They got the Harlequin pendulum. Uh, binary Lazarus. I think that's already been there. Uh, cloaks are definitely the same. SSDD, a lot of missed potential and change. Like, I just don't know what to say. I'm just going to go to orbit. Uh, well, I better get, I better pick up some uh, bounties first. I don't know, people. Like, like, 
Like, I was excited at first when I saw those new weapons. I said, surely they're going to have a lot more different stuff like in the other vendors. And, and then I go to the other vendors and, like, it's just paint jobs and and perk changes and name changes and practically the same looking gun. And I'm like, man, dude, you, you can't be serious. You just can't be serious. And people got excited for this. They got hyped for it. I'm just hoping the story is not a let down. I hope it's, it's not just a, a small collection of cutscenes and and mediocre uh, short-lived battles. Uh, I I just don't know, folks. We're gonna find out though. We are gonna find out. Let me go to orbit here. Destination station. Okay, see, I've still got stuff left over for some reason from the. Uh, thought I completed that, but I guess I didn't. So let's just go to the uh, iron, rise of iron emblem and uh, get into this bad boy and see. Uh, King of the mountain, Lord Saladin has called you to defend an abandoned mountaintop observatory from the fallen assaults. Level two eight uh, two hundred and eighty uh, normal uh, level forty two story. Um, let's go. Let us go, folks. In the years after the collapse, the world had no guardians. It had only iron lords. Immortal, fearless, we fought to protect the survivors of a once great age. Our battle was about more than crawling back from the shadows. The Iron Lords would give humanity back its future. Legend. But no one truly knows how the Iron Lords died their final deaths. That was something you had to be there for. To witness. To remember. To know even heroes can die. And survival is not always a victory. Now I am the lone sentry, and my watch is eternal, waiting for the day when whatever we disturbed awakens. The Iron Lords are gone, but our fight is far from over. House of Devils is back. 
and they're digging into old Golden Age research labs all across the system. This isn't a simple smash and grab. They're on a mission. At first, the Vanguard wasn't particularly concerned. At least, not until the Devils decided to move back into the Cosmodrome. Now the Devils are shifting a massive amount of resources to an area nearby that's been dark for centuries. Normally, I'd say it's just another day. Except, what's really got everyone talking is that Lord Saladin has left his post at the Iron Banner to take charge of the situation personally. Only rather than go straight to the Cosmodrome, Saladin wants us to investigate an abandoned observatory in the mountains. Very strange. Okay, so I'll be honest, that was a pretty cool uh, intro, it was a little short, uh, I like the uh, cinematics, uh, it's a pity that a uh, female character had to die, I thought she looked cool, I uh, think had a lot of motion to it, uh, I said a fallen as decent tone. My team and I are en route, but we won't get there in time, I need you to secure the observatory at the top. It is imperative the Fallen do not establish a foothold on that mountain. Like I said, a decent tone the for the, uh, are working their story. way up the mountain. Their goal is to take Vostok Observatory. What would the Fallen want in an abandoned outpost? Things that are left buried. There is a gondola near your location. Take it up to the observatory. There's a lot of uh, dialogue getting you uh, situated, understanding things. And uh, I guess it says a proper tone for thing you had, but. It seems a bit rushed, if I were to be honest, like a li little short, like for an intro, like if I remember correctly, like like the uh, previous DLCs, they were uh, actually, they actually seemed a little more lengthy, uh, the uh, intro material a little more dramatic, not saying that that didn't have its emotion and whatnot, salad and running towards uh, his uh, Comrade in arms trying to, you know, get her to stop from doing what she did, but I, I just don't know. It, it seemed a bit rushed to me. Uh, well, this hasn't been activated for more than 400 years. So there's a gondola. We're going to get right in a gondola thing here. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. I like the environment, uh, the mountain, the snow, um, looks more Earth-like than most of the, uh, levels, you know, like in the Swiss Alps or something here. Uh, With this, this sort of reception, it might be a touch ambitious to think we can secure the entire observatory. There's a courtyard in the rear of the facility. If you can secure that, you should be able to keep them from the Iron Temple until we arrive. Wait, Iron Temple? Like Iron Banner? Iron Lords? Stay focused. There's too much at stake. Watch out! Uh oh, things, things can shoot me from outside. Whoa. That's a different touch, actually. It's like a new type of, uh... ...thing. I don't 
think I like this little metal box anymore. Yeah, you kind of a sitting duck. Kind of a sitting duck. You can't take another hit like that. Jump. Okay, we shall jump. Let's do it. I don't understand. If there's something so important up there, why wasn't the Vanguard protecting the temple all these years? This place and its secrets are my responsibility. So yeah, this is definitely like a uh, mountain ascent here, so it's uh, keeping true to the uh, nature of the uh, situation. This is more than a few fallen, just for the record. Uh, okay. One to claim what lies on I do like the environments here. The environments are pretty cool. Uh, the snow blowing, the uh, attention to detail does not disappoint, actually. Uh, where, uh, it says I was supposed to go somewhere. Um, uh, Okay, that is, uh... I think I died. Yeah, that was kind of misleading. Uh, <laughs> I died at the beginning, like, like... Trying to lead me to or something. I heard something. Yep. I thought I heard something. Man, these dudes are more aggressive too. Man, how many of them are there, dude? They're coming out of nowhere, like. Man, dude. Peter Shank. It looks like a different design, though. I'll be honest. Like it's uh, looks like a different kind of Shank. Uh, I'm sure there's ghosts hidden in this environment somewhere. Just that does not sound too be inviting. Careful. Picking something up nearby. Like, the enemies, like, at my current level, they still feel like the, uh, enemies you had faced in the, the earlier, like, uh, expansions. Is that... Looks like a bomb or something. There's a nasty-looking deal up there. Uh, yeah, I probably should not it's have. Right. It's right. Be dead. Yeah, it should be dead. It's a zombified version. Odd in the energy signature. It's not fallen, but it's regenerating. Did you say it's regenerating? Kill Sepix Guardian. Kill it now. I'm trying to. Its shield is, uh, not down. Okay. Where? I hear it. I don't see it. I don't That's see. what I think it is. The temple doors will not be strong enough to hold it back. You must destroy it before that happens. Mm -hmm. So that's our threat. Whatever it's infected with is the... Uh... Do not 
problem. Enter that temple. Uh, there's no arrow on the uh, friggin' friggin' radar. It's immune. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Tell me. Anyone? Okay, now let's take a damage. might mean the uh, introduction to a new type of uh, and those things came out of nowhere yep detecting reinforcements approaching your coordinates yeah yeah a little too late on that uh, Shaxx you a little yeah a little too late on announcing that stuff uh, being bombarded being Shot. Yeah. Uh, uh, this is bull S. Uh, I can't get a bearing on stuff. I'm being shot by a ship. I'm being shot by Septus. It's a little much, uh, Bungie. A little, little much. A little much, you pricks. It's, a, it's, a, it's that formula I hated about your earlier games where you're, uh, we're using the troops, the lesser troops, and the other things to distract from the boss that is. Like, yeah, you need to stop that. You need to freaking stop it. Like, the main focus is supposed to be the boss, not the freaking little minions. You must hold the mountain, Guardian. Shut the frick up. Yeah, th this is bullshit. This is like extreme bullshit. The boss is not the problem. The boss is not the threat that it should be. The boss is not the threat that it should be. It's the minions, it's the ships that are interfering with the fight. Uh, cowardice, cowardice boss fights. Uh, I can't hide anywhere. There's no cover. Uh, This is bullshit. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. This is like, uh, this is like bullshit. This is the same thing they pulled with the last expansion. That boss should be powerful enough on its own. They play it up as it is. Yet, yet the only real threat here is being killed by ships that are interfering. And, uh, Minions that are like swarming you as all the shit's going down. Uh, this is the this is bu uh, Bungie's mentality of a boss fight. Like this is bullshit. You can't you can't focus on the boss because you're being bombarded by stupid shit and. Uh, Man, this is the stupidest boss fight like I have ever I have yet to see. Like like Bungie, really. Really, I, I've said this before, like to my friends, like you wanna make a boss fight about the boss. Especially when the boss is supposed to be the all powerful thing. Not the uh Look, it just keeps coming. Like like what the fuck? Like what the fuck? Is this shit? It, I can't even focus on the damn boss. Seriously. Can't even focus on the boss because I'm being shot by everything else. Like, come on. Stop it with the fucking ships and the fucking... The dregs and the little... Little shits. Can't even focus on it. It's, it it's, this is like the worst. This 
can't be soloed like look I'm, I'm being bombed I'm, I'm being fucking killed I'm gonna die because of bullshit like 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 look I'm almost dead the things hit me from everywhere uh, I can't I can't get away like like the ships there like like what the fuck what the fuck this is like a last this is like a raid boss right here man Ew, this is shit it's not it's not even the boss that's the problem what the frick bungee what the what the hell is your problem What the hell is your problem? I mean, really, seriously. Did you did you not understand? Like, when it's a boss fight, it's supposed to be like about the boss, not about every other l little lesser insignificant thing that's in the. Uh... Look, look, that is ridiculous. Like, nah, nah I am pissed about this. No, no, you all can't take, you can't take cover all the way up the stair. There is no big enough wall. No. Even old wolves still bite. Shiro, what's your status? Circling around to make sure the area is clear. Be there in a sec. Well done, Guardian. The temple is secure. Now we can... Zero, get a lock on it. I just picked up... Wait, multiple impacts near the wall in Sector 17. They're attacking the sensor grid. They must know where Siva is. Guardian, go to the Cosmodrome immediately. If Sepix escapes, the Fallen won't be our only problem. <laughs> yeah, I'm a bit pissed about that, man. They done... They pulled... They took what they did last time to a more severe level like it's less about the boss than it is about everything else shooting at you like that's that's ridiculous that is ridiculous uh boss fights man it's supposed to be about the boss that's, that's why it's called a boss fight bungie does not get this concept another fail like uh yeah, Random Furby, be sure to watch the beginning of this video when I go over the tower and check out all the uh, the vendors and, and all the weapons that look practically the same with reskins on them. Uh, so far, I am I am not too impressed by this. I am I am not. I'll be honest. They they they've made mistakes over and over again. SSDD out the wazoo. Uh, I just don't know anymore. I just don't know anymore. Like, yeah, I'm speechless. I, I just don't know how this can get any better at this point. If that's going to be the boss mentality every time, like, you're going to have to deal with, like, extreme swarms of ships and and uh, minions. Yeah, that is that is a bad, bad design that is uh, worse than it was before. Like, I'm surprised I soloed that without dying. I was so close to death, like, dodging everything. The, the thing was practically warping everywhere I was at. Shoot me. The ships were on the other side shooting. Uh, minions coming up everywhere. Every end. Like, it, it's ridiculous. It's like, uh... I, I don't even freaking know. Look, I got a thing that I can't carry. Uh, 340. Ah, uh, the bigger light level machine gun. So the blue stuff is up. 
uh, and level. That's pretty cool. Dude. Strange coin. Could have used a weapon instead of that. Uh, let's see, 333. Man, that's a 333 blue. I don't like fusion rifles though. That sucks. Uh, green, 195. Still dropping greens. Um, blue, 340. A, a blue 340 helmet. Oh man. I wonder if I can infuse that. Man, let's see. I'm gonna see. Test it out. Test it, test it out. Yes, I can. That is good. Okay, 340. Man, if I would have known that, I would have dismantled that uh, freaking. Uh... Well, actually, it was 333, so I didn't need it. Uh, anyways. See what I can get. See what I can get. By the way, thanks for joining Random Furby. You know, sorry you had to hear me like that, man, but I was I was beyond agitated. I I just could not uh three thirty three. Um I can use that. Uh let's see. See if I can. Oh, Thorn, don't work. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, man. Uh, yeah. I'll be honest. That was that was that was everything I didn't want it to be. That was everything I did not want it to be. I'm gonna put that uh, Taken Sword up since I don't really need the Taken Sword anymore. Put that up. Three forty. I can. I can use that for sure. Three forty. Uh. Three forty. Um. See. Okay. Uh. I think that's it. I see nothing else. Uh, I don't think I see anything else. Anyways. Did you get the expansion random? Uh, you get it? Let's see... What can we do? 33 well hopefully if you're really intent on it this doesn't turn you away but like I said I've seen some things like that are disheartening you know uh, some things that just uh, show a little bit of laziness a little bit of rush and uh, yeah, it's uh, one of those deals, I guess. Uh, infinite grips. Things. Um. Yeah, I don't want to spoil too much for you, so uh, I'll probably do one more. I don't even know. I don't even have any more Iron Banner things listed. Uh, yeah, Rise of Iron. Okay. 290. Yeah, I don't really want to spoil anything else for anybody. I just, uh, be sure to go back and watch the stream. I'm going to upload it to my YouTube channel. I'll probably tweet a link. Uh, you'll see what I saw in the tower earlier. Uh, the, the weapons and whatnot. The uh, new shader that you got to buy for 75000 Oh, well, in that case, we can continue, I guess. I'll probably play... Until it reaches the hour point, uh, and then we can uh, move forward from there. I don't think there's anything here. Yeah, it's just a raid that I didn't do. 
And the raid that I didn't do. Okay. We'll continue then. I'm sure you're curious to see what it's about, if it's worth your money or whatnot. So, we'll, we'll get it get it going here. Lord Saladin, you said the Fallen knew about SIVA, but I can't find a reference to SIVA in the Vanguard database. That's because I went to great lengths to lock it away. The records are in the Iron Temple. Okay, but if the Fallen already know about SIVA, then shouldn't we? What you need to do now is track Sepix. If we find him, we will know the extent of the corruption. Sepix, I thought we just killed Sepix. Also, another question, like, the intro, it says they're immortals, but they died, they got infected, or okay, supposedly they I died, I could be wrong. Me more. The giant catch? Or whatever took a bite out of the wall? Guardian, it's Shiro. You're gonna need some cover. Make for the Cosmodrome. Stuck on environment. Yay! There's a lot more enemy activity in this too, like I've noticed. Seems to be a lot more enemy activity trying to distract you from your uh, destination goal. We need to get through that wall. So this is back at the the beginning, like this is where most of the Kells the Rex gone. and the cars yeah, were in the first game, the first uh, quarter. Saladin, you mentioned a sensor grid. Can we use that to tell how far this occupation extends? The Fallen are irrelevant, Shiro. The only thing that matters now is finding Sepix. Oh, I needed to write a stupid sniper. Uh, crap. I'll probably use two one. With some fire plank. Don't, don't dance, dude. Just take the bullets like you're supposed to. Uh oh, things, things and stuff. Laser cut like uh, Star Wars effects. Yay! By the way, if you haven't got a good Zeranea uh, D roll, uh, try for one because this is a beast of a gun if you got like a good balance perk and a uh, damage perk with it. Good, good gun. Good. Nice magazine size. Totally, totally missed that somehow. Yeah, he's a little upset his friend's guy uh, got left behind and trapped inside that uh, thing of a jig. I know it's attacking me, but it backed off a bit, I guess. Now see, I can understand the enemies being more aggressive, more more numerous and the uh you know the up to the boss but like man when it when it's on the boss like that that is kind of uh crazy 
Well, actually, actually, she was infected. Uh, that's why she she uh, closed the door to blow up the. Uh, she had a charge in her hand, like a uh, a trigger, like a explosive trigger. You could see it on her uh, armor. She had been affected, infected by that uh, whatever Siva, whatever the uh, the junk was. She would have, if she would have got out, she would have risked and spreading the uh, thing. So, yeah. And by the time she pulled that trigger, that thing was already on top of her, that swarm of whatever, whatever that stuff is. They couldn't even kill that stuff in that intro. But still no sign of Sepix. What is that pattern over there? Can we take a closer look? That looks like a disease. I'm picking up some strange readings. It's like what was on Sepix, but if I didn't know any better, I'd say this stuff is consuming everything around it. And why are we here? That is Siva. <laughs> With the proper direction, it could create anything a civilization would need. At least in theory. I uh, see, so they tried to use it to, uh... The hive tend to keep to the dark. Something is driving them into. So we got a little bit of everything here. We got hive. We got fallen. We got what nuts? What nuts? Let's oh. say go up there. What am I supposed to go up there or something? Oh, I can't even get up there. Ah. Uh, in the world, why does it want me to? I guess I go around here. Oh, things and stuff and stuff and things. Uh, there's a lot of uh, wizards. A lot of wizard activity. something flying up in the air scanning something see that thing what is that what is that thing it's weird Landscapes def definitely uh, changed a bit. actually like this environment better. It looks looks better actually. This is I'm um, shooting one, another one pops up in front of it. Whoa. I just lost all readings from the sensor grid. There's a monitoring station near your location. Hook into it and try to get the grid back online. No problem.
Okay, so there's a hole in the wall now. A new environment, I guess. Whoa, and that thing did not do nice things. Okay. Um, there's not enough left of the sensor grid to fix. Wait, wait. We can pull the logs from the monitoring station. Would that be enough to figure out what these fallen are up to? Do it. Something weird incoming. Uh, something cool not happening. Uh, new these enemies. Oh yeah. With some sort of technology, like sepics. Okay. Or not, we need that sensor data. On the bright side, these fallen aren't coming back to life like sepics. At least, not yet. Yellow dude, I'm about to die. Use your tools, Brad. Use your tools. Okay, so that dude had a void shield. scary than the taken to be honest like or uh more threatening good character design for sure whoa things and stuff and stuff and things got everything i could out of the center logs nice job guardian but we still have to deal with epics we no longer need the servitor shiro I've seen enough to know the Fallen have restarted production of SIVA. Guardian, we've established a base at the Iron Temple. Join us here. Okay. Well, anyway, I'm gonna have to, uh... Close it off after that. I, uh, thank you for joining me, Random. Uh, really appreciate it. If you missed anything from the beginning of the stream, uh, go back and watch it when I upload it to YouTube. Probably be your best bet. Uh, yeah. Um, anyways, I think that'll be about it. Uh, uh, I don't want to spoil anything else beyond that. You're welcome, dude. Uh, <laughs> Sorry you had to see me have that uh, verbal breakdown there. Uh, <laughs> hear me have that verbal breakdown. But, uh, yeah. Maybe to give you an idea of what the game is is like or about. If anybody else watches, maybe they can get a brief uh, idea to... I uh, shall talk at you later, dude. And uh, take it easy. Like uh, Maybe we can join up for some stuff if you get it. Later. Bye. <laughs> True. <laughs>